Rap a tap tap. Here's Bojangles. Think of that by Leo and Diane Dillon. To Bond, as always. Also for Bill Robinson and Aaron Douglas, who created great art through adversity and who inspired this book. There once was a man who danced in the street. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He brought pleasure and joy to the people he'd greet. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He didn't just dance, he made art with his feet. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He danced past doors. Some were open, some closed. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He danced past folks in fancy clothes. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He danced through a place people call the skids. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He danced through crowds of laughing kids. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. His feet fairly flew as he tipped his hat. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He briefly paused to pat an old cat. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He danced rain or shine in all kinds of weather. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. People listen each day for his toe tapping clatter. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He danced many rhythms that were seldom the same. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. Dance was his passion, and it brought him fame. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. Bojangles, Bojangles. That was his name. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. Afterward, Bill Bojangles Robinson, eighteen seventy eight to nineteen forty nine is known as the greatest tap dancer of all time. His fame has reached mythic proportions. He had charm and charisma, and it was said he talked with his feet. His rhythms were so intricate and fast, it was impossible for other dancers to repeat some of them. During the Great Depression of the 1930s, Bill Robinson was the highest paid black entertainer. He shared his wealth with less fortunate friends and neighbors through those hard times. Bill Robinson performed shows on Broadway as well as in famous clubs around the country. He formed reviews that appeared in vaudeville and he danced in several films, including four with the child star Shirley Temple. On May 25, 1989, Congress declared that day, which was his birthday, as National Tap Dance Day in Bill Robinson's honor. The end.